Hey guys, and welcome in to another SW Districts career mode episode. Today we've got a couple games for you. We are um, in a very good position on the table, but first and foremost, you guys will see the Northern Cape and Eastern games. So this will decide if we get to the next round or not. So very important games to win. Um, you guys will last here for the two wins against Umpalanga by eight wickets and beating Limpopo by eight, 19. Took on border here, and they posted 329 for six. Wessels, 149 off 82. 12 fours, four sixes. Nemand, 95, 110, 11 boundaries there. Sterling at the top, 66 or 65. Tough day for the bowlers. I thought Whitehead and Sub Rayan uh, bowled quite well, and this is the pay season. Dupacy struggling today. But it was the performance from Dupacy. What a knock. 179 of 115 deliveries. 27 fours, six, um, six sixes. Tore this attack apart and virtually gave them no chance here. So his wagon wheel was just sublime. And Manat picking up his third 100 of the campaign, just continuing his good form. Did a good job. He just supported there along the way. The punch, it was 275 for that wicket. So a very nice result. And a tough game against Kazulu and Natal Inland. Got them out for 234. It was a good bowling effort this time round. Milan 3 for 44. Height a two for fifty, two for forty-six for Duper C and Subrayan. And Whitehead did a fantastic job as well. The spin is phenomenal in that effort. It was a tough chase. Two thirty-eight for seven. Um, we were eighty-eight for four and a good partnership between Duper C and Varane. No, uh, no, sorry, Hall and Varane. Uh, with Varane top scoring with eighty of hundred and fifteen deliveries, to our boundaries. Hall sixty of eighty-three. It was a tight finish. Yeah, we only got through with one delivery left. Milan, fifteen of twelve getting us home there and yeah good performance from them as well um Suplama, two for 49 one for 39 for peruk kumalo 243 and 142 for dukes where does that put us on the table it puts us in a very decent position actually going into the final couple of games if we can pick up one win i'd say we are in the um nick the quarter well, top two from division one go through the final can we um get promoted um to division one and just get more high quality cricket get an extra match and these teams will be a massive step up for us if we're able to get there but we've got to we've got to win one of these two games playing top of the table northern cape rain has gone away on international duty team has been picked i've gone for another um bowling option bring moon back from injury it's been very successful at the top with kosia and rickleton monarch at three duper c at four hall at five Moving Hall up one position. Lord Milan's going to be handy where he is at six. Whitehead, so Ryan, a handy men to have. Like 18, 19, a respect for averages. Pike for 15. Moon and Duper C. So we've got a lot of good options here. We're going to open up with Moon and uh, Marcelo there. Conditions are perfect. They're great batting conditions. We've got to um, do well if we are to bat first. And we will bat first. We have to start well. And put this team under severe pressure here. So that's the key. Let's get a score on the board. Bat reasonably well. So then. Yeah we're not under pressure. Be good to contest the Division 2 final. Especially in the first season. Especially with the depth being um, tested as much as it is. But yeah very happy with some of the youth players. Like good to see Hall amongst runs. Monarch getting a few runs as well. Um, just good future guys for the team, really. And Rickleton and Varane were good signings as well. Uh, Varane away on international duty, but Rickleton can take the gloves. I'm um, in this format. It's a beautiful shot. It's a lovely start here for these two. 50 out on the board. It's Rickleton right. It's another boundary up. 33 25, looking relatively nice at the moment. And that's Coatsy out and Monarch. Splendid form. 300s in the um, one day campaign so far. You want to continue that good form for his side. He wants to break records, this youngster. He's going to have to keep his consistency up. That's a good shot again. Well controlled hook. That's four more. Good restrictions ended. 64th one after 10. Record 33. Monarch 9. SW Districts will be probably the happier of the two teams. Gonna work the boundaries. Rickleton is getting into his work. <coughs> Played a little bit for South Africa this season. Rickleton, he's been drawn into that shot though, and he has been dismissed. Brings Duper C to the crease with an impressive average of 44. 
uh, gets out of wave before. So, so the game is in a pretty um, interesting state at the moment. These two, of course, putting on two hundred and seventy-five for that wicket. Um, that um, eight wicket win, chasing three hundred, was so impressive. Just too short. Manark um, gets it away um, of Kutzian. Shot again. Finds the gap. Goes to 24 off 18. So striking over 100. Like they're just putting pressure on these bowls. Got to get over well over 300. I really just want to put these guys under pressure. <coughs> Um, well, one gets us promotion anyway, and that's exactly what we want to be doing in the save. One, we're testing ourselves against the best um, cricketers on the circuit. One, get players playing for South Africa as well. Very crucial. That's a good shot from Monarch. Moves to 41 of 29. Nine boundaries in his inning so far. Do you perceive very slow to start off with so far? So one eighteen for two. Putting a lot of trust in Hall today, like putting him up to five. He's played some really fighting knocks so far. That's a big six from Monarch. Jim Dubasee's gone. Good delivery from Court Z and Dubasee for 14. Andy Hall's got two fifties in the campaign so far, so he'll be looking to add to that. Yet another score past 50 for Monarch. He's got a bat right through now. He's got to be the anchor of this innings. Fastest 50 against these guys. Just got to hang in there. 10 fours and a 6. A lot of dot balls in between though. But he's getting his team in a very strong position. 21 overs and 150 up already. This can be sustained from SW Districts, will be the key. <clears throat> Just got to get a boundary every couple of hours, work the singles. Let's put these guys under immense pressure. It's a good shot. Drifting into the pads, Monarch gets that away for four. And Hall's gone, so they've lost another wicket at a key interval here. South for 18 off 23. Brings Andre Milan to the crease. You want probably Milan to probably score a few today. He's got a bit of a sky out there. He's got it away for four. He's got to bat some time. He's got to set our sights well over 300. It's a good shot from Milan. He beats a short fine leg, which is an interesting um, fielding position considering... <clears throat> that um, is an area that will pepper. Oh, he's got a leading edge there, but he will get away with it. 201 for four, so good fight back here from Northern Cape. Doing a good job with the ball now, just sort of after the SW districts. Just lost a bit of class in their lineup with Rain being caught up to international duty. Van Rensburg. We just want Milan betting time. Just getting his average is probably just good enough at this period of time of the game. It's a good shot from Monarch. He's continuing on. Moose 87. Been a very measured innings from him uh, so far. He's just got to calculate when to launch. That's a good shot. He moves into the 90s. Terrible delivery there. Milan has been trapped from Rasamini. The 33 brings Sean Whitehead to the crease. And Monarch's gone too. He's going to fall short of his 100. And all of a sudden, SW Districts have just crumbled a wee bit. Just got to make sure we bat the overs. And keep scrambling quite well. If we can get our sights to 300. Give our bowlers something very decent to bowl to. These two are very capable with the bat. So is Moon. For that matter. We're going to try and keep Moon, the Englishman, in the team for a while anyway. Like, he provides a little bit of batting. 
That's what I really like. Subrain is gone. And yeah, credit to Northern Cape. They've just chipped away. They have not worried about the accelerating rate. They've taken wickets of regular and intervals. It's really just stifled our innings, really. Let's see how they get set away for four. Whitehead gone for ten. Andy Moon. Let me focus on batting out these overs. That is the absolute key. Two eighty one for eight. Anything over three hundred is just par, really. Two overs remaining. It's a massive shot from Moon that's just flowing over the sight screen. Back to back sixes. The Englishman getting on with things here. Three hundred and two for eight into the final over as Moon departs for 22 off 19. A very handy score. 306 for nine with Monarch the mainstay of 95. Just falling short of a fourth hundred in the campaign. That is a very impressive um, one day campaign. Very classy player and now we're going to sort of bowl to a good plan and hope we can take early wickets up front. A little bit of aggression. Line into the attack. Literally. 34 without loss after 10. It's exactly the start they probably want in Northern Cape. As we'll bring in Dupacy. We'll just both a little bit of aggression here. Just want to sort of still hunt some wickets. One over for two. We'll bring in Whitehead. Just want to be very much. Yeah, just. Looking for that first breakthrough of the innings. So, Dupacy to Keem. Dupacy gets it in the right area. And Keem is gone. Gone for 24. Spinner's doing a really good job here. They've really put Northern Cape in a tangle. 8.1 and over. It's very steep. So, Brian into the attack. We'll just be looking for some good overs from him now. Are they going to target him? One over for one. Milan into the attack. And now we're just, again, just trying to get fielders on the fence. Cover some options. They've batted a wee bit too slow, Northern Cape, I feel. They're just creating pressure for themselves, trying to up the rate later on. They haven't lost any wickets yet. These two needed to accelerate. 45 or 67. Probably not good enough in this run, Chase. So Rayan is just benefiting from the good work up front. So Rafsan. He walked apart for 23. Bangladesh. Ryan Rafsan. He's a very interesting signing. Ravado Moonsami. Just taking Roy Sellers as a start. He's, he looks like a classy act as well. So there's players about it. Nine and over required. That is so steep. Just so much pressure on these batsmen just with the slow start. And, and again, it's just a good discipline bowling performance. So Rayan amongst the wickets now. He's got three. Milan's bought a very tidy spell. We're going to bring Duper C back as well. There's Duper C. We'll be just looking to just get through some good overs here. And get his um, statistics up a wee bit. Oh, so Rayan again. He's had a fantastic day. you got to keep your good guy on. Really here, Sillers is going to be out. He's gone for 18. We'll bring in Marcelo. I think the spinner's done a really good job here. It's just it's so steep. 10.5 and over with not too many wickets in hand. It's a good delivery from Marcelo. Vujoin is uh, gone for 36. Coulson is gone for 26 or 15. Good um, explosive knock, really. Good spell. Four for 60 for Sarayan. He was dispensing towards the back end of his um, spell there, but he's done the job exactly what's required. 101 at 12.6 now. I'm mean, just looking to get some overs in um, here. We're going to bring Whitehead in. Field nice and spread. Looks like 
Our team, SW Districts, are going to be in the final, at least, of the uh, Division 2 um, competition. And we're going to be promoted for next season. The standard will be remarkably different. And that is a great performance in the end. Bowling them out for 250. Winning by 56 runs. It was good enough in the end. And a good day out for Monarch, 95. 4 for 60 for Saran. He was a pretty good signing, too, at the end of the day. He's just provided what we needed. He's done a wee bit of a good job in areas. Could have did a wee bit more off the bat, obviously. But very nice. 2 for C1 for 41 there. A youngster. Guy we're trying to rapidly develop in our program. He looks like a promising find, uh, really. He's someone I really want to keep um, tabs on. So, perfect 5-5. Five and five. Uh, 21 points. Can't be passed by Northern Cape. Cannot be passed by Easterns as well. So, we are effectively in the final. And we probably could rest a couple of players, but I want to keep people going, obviously. So, this will be an interesting decision. Bryson will come into the um, team here, and we'll give pretty much Dubasi just the game off here, and give Bryson a debut. Victorious will come in for um, Coach Z um, and give him a bit of a run too. And let's see how we perform with this team. So we've gone with another seamer. And it does favour seam bowling. So let's hopefully do well here. We will bowl first on this um, surface. So Moon will be looking for wickets up front. We're just keeping in the same channels. That's been working for us this season. Hopefully, we can strike again. A couple four overs there. Spell. Uh, Bryson into the attack. Milan into the attack too. 40 without loss after 10. So, a nice start here for the eastern side. Yeah, like, like I said, we've got to give every one of our players that we're going to keep in this team for a long period of time a game, really. So, yeah, it's a good time to bring Bryson in. Three overs, none for 18. It's been a wee bit expensive today. We'll bring in our two very experienced uh, spinners. Feel pretty pleased to announce that we've got the uh, setup uh, here. Whitehead uh, to uh, Ditto. Um, Ditto is uh, going to be dismissed. He's gone for 30. Post Humus. Let's go for the attack. So Brian, who bowled pretty well in that last game, into the attack. Whitehead looks like he's going to be amongst it today. Easterns are a good good enough side at the end of the day to cause some problems. They've got, um, obviously, Dani Rousseau. Um, they've got some interesting players in that team, like that have been around the scene a wee bit, and some good averages there. A lot of developing players as well. But, yeah, this, this is good bowling from Whitehead, really. The, he's doing the job today, like someone else is stepping up. It's good wickets. Ran out of the attack. We'll bring um, Moon back in. Like how this Englishman's been getting pretty experienced uh, with us. Like his his stats are not going to be the greatest, but doing a good all rounder's job, you'd have to say. So hopefully, his development will continue with us alongside his county side. So he just. It's that favourite experience. And Whitehead picks up another wicket. He's got all four of them so far. A Vizar gone for 23. Whitehead's going to be rotated out. We're going to bring Milan in. And it's just a containing job at the moment from this performance so far. Just bringing it back after the very good start that uh, Easterns have made. So he will depart for 12. Bring Marcelo into the attack. We just want to keep attacking at really one end now to try to get these guys under some sort of pressure. Mashigo. And just losing very good at wickets, Easton. There's no momentum in the innings now. It's just deflated so, so quickly. Very balanced um, attack. Um, Bryson will be into the attack. Good chance for Bryson to get some, probably some overs under his belt. So he probably will bowl, probably out here. Bryson none for 28 off his four. I think we bring 
I think we bring some spin in now. Just get the field out. See if we can get some more wickets for Whitehead. Gonna sell our bowl out. One for thirty nine for um Pied. Uh, the one for that is a very good spell. We'll bring in Bryson again. Gonna trust Bryson to sort of get it right. So it's number 37. A lot of trust in a Milan into the attack. So 205 for 7 after 46. It's just been an innings where just nothing's really got going at all for Easton's. And Milan's getting amongst the wickets now. So we could be wrapping up pretty quickly here. That's the run out. Moon into the attack for the last over of the innings. 218 for 9. And I've got through to 226 for 9. So not a bad performance from the bowlers. You'd have to say Whitehead was outstanding. 4 for 43. His best figure is yet. He's taken 8 wickets in the campaign. He's done a good job. Milan's done a good job since he's played as well. 11 wickets at 28. 1 for 31 there. Bryson on debut. 9 for 41. He sort of battled. But it's a valuable experience. This is important. Want to continue our momentum into the final. So the final will be played on the uh, YouTube series. If we do finish top, I'll be stoked. Hopefully have some players back for them. Then we've got a small 20 over campaign to sort of try to uh, maneuver in. Be a chance for Rupert Torius to just get a hopefully a decent score. So Pinch at a six there. Free up 19 record and he's just struggling a wee bit. Not bad. 43 without loss. We're just doing a nice job at the moment. Just... Let us house to play us house, and we've got time. As long as we don't let the rate and game drag on for too long, just make sure we do it. 45, 46 overs. Just have a couple good overs remaining to get this total. Just want Pretorius to get some confidence. Get a pretty hard campaign, uh, Ru Pretorius, at first class level. Got found out a wee, but he's just learning at the level. Got to give him that exposure, though. So, let's get into the team. He's taken his chance today, however. He may find himself playing in the final. If he gets a big one. Because Cop C um, did not get really anything significant. It's a good shot. And we're just up the rate a wee bit now. Just, just because it's creeped over five and over. Don't want it to go any close to six. We don't want to get, put ourselves under too much pressure. It's a half century for Rupertorius on debut. 5.5 5 and over. It's not going to be an easy chase, I do think, now. But they've got their tails up a wee bit. Even though we haven't lost a wicket, we haven't really taken the game away yet. Not the sort of the shackles to be broken, really. And Rickleton, he will depart for 45 of 86. So he's battled a wee bit today. Want to get Monarch sort of settled in. Try to get some more runs into this very impressive campaign of his. It's a good shot. Torres get away for four. Leading from the front uh, on debut, especially. This is other people stepping out. A lot of people amongst the runs. Um, a lot of people in form. That's what we want. That's a good shot down the ground. 13 off the over now. So that moves um, Vittoria 75 95 Monarch runnable at the moment. Just got himself in at 6. And 41 for one. The clerk to Monarch. Monarch. 
having none of that, that sucks. Taurus, he will depart for 87 off 111 deliveries. He's played a handy knock. Would have loved to have kicked on to get that ton. He's going to stop um, Daniel Monarch, though. He's just in such good touch. Another handy contribution today with the bat. Jupiter's had that massive 100. That's sort of put him on the map for our team for a future um, prospect, actually, as well. He's just doing a good job. Uh, Monarch's got a free hit here. This should be punished. And it will be. Beautiful shot along the canvas. Very happy with our team in this one-day campaign. Very good first season, in fact. It seeded my expectations majorly uh, so far. Monarch, he will depart. That's a good score, though. He's contributed a very handy 34. He's kept, he's got the run chase kick-started, really. Good shot. Paul. Paul with a couple of 50s in the campaign. He's sort of just... Gonna take a, probably a wee bit time and wee bit longer than others to probably develop to the talent that he's got. He will depart though. He's gone for 11 off 14. So the wheels are just slightly falling off. But it's been a pretty polished episode, really. 19 now. 21 at 3.5. It's a dicey run. That's out. He's out by miles. So the. We're just putting unnecessary pressure on ourselves, and that's the frailty of our order. Uh, really, just 15 required. It's going down to an unnecessary time in the game. We should have probably clinically finished this off. There are some flaws in our team. We're a bit one batsman light probably in this team. Just for, for a rain out. But we've done the job. We are unbeaten in round robin. I play very good innings from uh, Mr. Rue Pretorius. So he's taking his chance. He will play in the final. Monarch with a handy 34. And he just 491 runs in six games. 300s, 150. Incredible performance. And I've done the job here. So we are going to be in the next league. So obviously we don't get to play um, in a final. Which is a shame. It's the top team. No, we, we do. Division 2 playoff. Division 2 playoff. So promotion playoff. It's going to be quite interesting. We have to win this game. Um, that'll be the next episode, guys. So check this out uh, now. Smash the like button. Share with a friend. We'll see you next time.